The Atom 3.0 has intuitive settings menus that are controlled using three of its four buttons. Starting from the top left corner and moving clockwise, we have the Mode button, the Select button, the Light button, and the Advance button. Some of the buttons have two states, a simple push for less than two seconds, let's call this Press, and push and hold for two or more seconds, let's call this Hold. The main menu has several sub-menus. You can navigate the main menu by pressing either the Advance button or the Mode button. Every time you press the Advance button, you move to the next sub-menu in the list. Every time you press the Mode button, you move to the previous sub-menu in the list. To enter a sub-menu, press the Select button. Once you are inside a sub-menu, you can step back a menu level by holding the Select button. If you hold the Mode button, the Atom 3.0 returns to the previous menu. Let's now look at the Set F sub-menu. To enter the Set F sub-menu, while at the surface, press the Advance button until you see the Set F lead-in screen. Press the Select button to enter the Set F sub-menu. The Set F sub-menu has four sub-menus. Set FO2 Gas 1, Set FO2 Gas 2, Set FO2 Gas 3, and Set 50% Default. Let's look at the first one, the Set FO2 Gas 1 sub-menu. You can use this sub-menu to program the fraction of oxygen up to 100% for your primary tank. The default FO2 setting for each gas is air. When FO2 Gas 1 is set for air, O2 data and MOD will not be displayed. To change the FO2 value, press either the Advance or Mode button until you see the desired value on the screen. Let's set it to 32%. When gases are set for a numerical value, the dive is considered nitrox and the NX icon will be displayed. This screen contains the following information. Max depth allowed for the PO2 alarm and FO2 set, PO2 alarm value set with the PO2 message, NX icon, gas 1 icon, and flashing FO2 set point value with FO2 message. Hold the select button to ignore the value and to step back or press the select button to save the value and continue to the next gas. In this video we have given you an overview of the Oceanic Atom 3.0 settings. To learn more about the Atom 3.0, take the Atom 3.0 online specialty class at divecomputertraining.com. To practice with the Atom 3.0, use the eDiving Scuba Diving Simulator.